Okay, we're going to take a look at solving a question based on arc length. Okay, now arc length is the length of why isn't it? there we go, the length of this part of the circle. Okay, so we're not trying to find the whole circumference, we're just trying to find how long that part of the circle is if we know what the angle is. Okay, so I'm just going to do question nine to show you how to do it. Uh, it says a circle has a radius of 10 centimeters, an arc of the circle subtends an angle of 50 degrees at the center. Calculate the arc length correct to two decimal places. Okay, well, if we were to think about what that looks like, we've got a circle. Okay, it has a radius of 10 centimeters. And then this thing that says subtends just means that the arc has an angle which is 50 degrees there. And we're trying to find out this part. Okay, so to do that, all I'm going to do is use this formula. And it's pretty easy to work out what's going on. We've got uh, the first half is the circumference of a circle. So working out the whole circumference. And then the second half is multiplying that by what fraction of the circle we have. Okay, so let's plug it in. We've got 2 times pi times 10 for the radius multiplied by our angle 50 out of 360. And I'm going to go plug it in. Okay, 2 times pi times 10 times, I should use a bracket, 50 over 360 equals... 8.726 Now it had a whole heap of decimal places there. Do you see that? But the question only wants correct to two decimal places So if I write it down like that the six is actually going to round the two up to a three So there's our answer Okay, therefore the arc length Is 8.73 centimeters Done.